1857, or from 1857 to 1859, John Xantis, an amateur eco-scientist, sent samples of flora and fauna from this region to the Smithsonian. During his stationing at the fort for one and a half years, he sent many biological specimens not cataloged until then. He also identified, but did not collect, the condor, which is a vulture of immense size. Exantis stated that they were, not, they were quite numerous, being entirely confined to the high mountains of the region. Just as the gold rush greed destroyed many native plants and animals in the mountain area, so too were most of the native inhabitants killed throughout California during this time. Before the gold rush, the American Indian population in California was some 150,000 people. By 1870, it was about 30,000 Indians. And by the year 1900, the population had dwindled to only 15,000 of these first people. None were known to be still living in the Santa Medeo Mountains in the early 1900s. I stand here on this ridge, my fur covered in fresh snow. And I look down at the lights that fill the valley far below. We roamed these hills forever. We knew these mountains well. And our wisdom has been worn into a thousand forest trails. Brothers of Chumash and Kawaiasu walked as one with nature and taught from our totems too. The ranchers and the trappers, they shot us out of fear, blocked us off with barbed wire, caught our feet in deadly gear. Late at night, when you're safe at home, you will hear my voice calling across the valley far below. I am calling to my pack. I am calling to my clan. This is our land. This is our land. This is our land. Oh, I have met old Pacumio running through these granite hills. My heart is full of sorrow for the blood that has been spilled. Trapped into the missions, neophyte and slave, but he never gave up dreaming of the land they took away. Late at night, when you're safe at home You will hear old Paco Mio When the cold north wind blows He is calling to his people He is calling to his tribe This is our land This is our land This is our land All the mothers who were slaughtered And their children who were killed the suffering I've seen is something I can never tell. They told stories of their visions and they danced around the fire. They kept it all alive somehow through time so dark and dire. Late at night, when you're safe at home, you will hear my voice calling across the valley far below. I am calling to my pack. I am calling to my tribe. This is our land. This is our land. This is our land. And now we have returned. Round Mount Shasta we roam. But our brothers never made it to their ancient land and home. They were scattered on the four winds, pushed out for mortal gold, but their tie to these mountains is too sacred to let go. Late at night, when you're safe at home, 
You will hear my voice calling across the valley far below. I am calling to my people. I am calling to my tribe. This is our land. 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 I am the spirit of the wolf. 